Shabbat Shalom, everyone. Good Shabbos. As you can see, Hanukkah is quickly approaching, and it's such a beautiful holiday filled with a lot of joy, but also a lot of meaning. One of the symbols, of course, is that of the dreidel. And I have in front of me our Temple Emanuel dreidel. This is the largest dreidel in captivity, and it, it lives right here all year round. But I also brought my smallest dreidels. As an aside, you may know that I collect dreidels. This is my smallest one. It's the smallest one in captivity, and it also lives here. We think of a dreidel as just being a toy and a lot of fun, and it's a game, and it is, but actually the, the letters remind us of a very important message. And I'm gonna have uh, Jared actually spin this dreidel for us. The letters tell us, thank you, Jared. He's the official dreidel spinner. Nais Gadol Haya Sham, which means a great miracle happened there. And there refers to Israel. If you buy a dreidel in Israel, it says Nais Gadol Haya Po, a great miracle happened here. And what is the great miracle? We talk about a little bit of uh, oil lasting eight days, but the real miracle of Jewish life is Jewish survival against all odds through all the centuries and how lucky we are to be living here in America with a homeland in Israel because it hasn't always been that way. And that's what these letters remind us, that our fate was like a spinning dreidel and wherever it landed, very often that is uh, what we found ourselves having to deal with and cope with. And in many places and in many lands, it was a very difficult kind of a challenge for us. Another very important symbol is that of the menorah, the Hanukkah. And we are going to be lighting the lights. And there's much that can be said about the light and reigniting the light within you. A story that I really hold dear comes to us from Holocaust literature about a father and a son who were in a death camp. And in approach of Hanukkah, the father had been saving the little bit of ration of butter and not using it. And finally, on the first night of Hanukkah, the father took that little bit of butter, like the oil, and he used it for the light. And his son was horrified. And he said, Dad, how could you be using this butter that we need to live on? It's, our, it's one of our few rations, and you're using it for the Hanukkah light? He said, yes, my son, learn this, that we have learned in this camp that we can live for up to three days without water. You have even seen that we have lived close to a week without food but you cannot live even one day without hope. And that's really the message of the light as well. Hope in the future and our future and of a better day. So we light the light, we spin the dreidel, we sing the songs, we gather family together, and we are proud, proud to be Jewish and able to celebrate freely. This Friday night, we have Mini Minion, and we have Come As You Are, both at 6 o'clock. We have an 8 o'clock service as well, and during that service, we will be blessing all of those confirmants traveling to Israel right around Hanukkah time. They'll celebrate Hanukkah in Israel along with Rabbi Cernovitz. And just a reminder that this Sunday, it's our big chance to reclaim the Guinness Book of Records for the number of dreidel spins. We need you, we need every one of you. We need 740 dreidels spinning at the same time. We're counting on you to be with us and plan to be at the temple, I would say, uh, around 10, 10, 15, so this spin can take place at 10.30. Thank you so much, Shabbat Shalom, and Happy Hanukkah in advance.